teaching a Tailslindian Gardens and Elysian Siemens teacher. The science fair is soon, all of you are supposed to do a special project. Loopy and I are going to do a project about rocks thereby going gem mining at Emerald Hollow Mine in Hiddenite. Lydia will help us out, that's for sure. I am going to do mine about stars, thereby using my telescope. I am going to do mine about horses by reading a book titled Misty of Jim Katogan by going on a horse and carriage right through historic Santa Angela. Oh no! Everyone, as well as Martha, Ally, Junior, and Lutby, had an idea except me. Is there any way? Don't worry, Darren, it is okay to search for stuff that you need for your own project. But don't worry, the possibilities are endless. If you look at the science section of the library's website on your computer, there are lots and lots of ideas. Like Mrs. Murphy told you during class, the possibilities are endless. Have you tried building a makeshift rocket ship? Well, I did, but no matter how hard me and my mom tried, we didn't fly to the moon unlike real rockets and space shuttles. Have you traveled to a SpaceX rocket launch? Have you dug near your own garden for any dinosaur bones? One day, I dug and dug with my mom's gardening shovel which she does her everyday planting, but all I found was one of your golden retrievers chewing bones. Have you visited a dinosaur exhibit at the Tailslandian Riverside Historic Museum of Natural History? Well, want to go to a restaurant for dinner? I'll drive you there, along with your mom, Christina, and Riley. Well, Riley, we search for stuff to look for on my laptop at the library, but it turns out, there is nothing, absolutely nothing. Even Marissa gave me suggestions, but I refuse them. Well, you don't have to use suggestions from Diamond Leaf or look something up online for your project. Well, I have a suggestion for you. How about you do a project about caterpillars? How does that sound? Caterpillars? Oh wow. I'll search facts about caterpillars on my computer when I get home. Thank you so much for the advice and suggestions, Miss Grammy. Darren, I'll have you know that a caterpillar starts its life as an egg. When it hatches, it eats leaves and flowers all day and all night long. When I was little, probably about age 3 or 4 in 2008 or 2009, I read a book by Eric Carl called The Very Hungry Caterpillar. If you need some help finding caterpillars outside to put in a special box with some leaves and flowers for them to eat, I'll help you out. Okay. Since I have new color thing cartridges for my HP Office Jack Pro 8028 printer, I'm going to print out the facts right now. Okay, Darren, good luck with that. There. All of my facts are printed out. I'll set them next to my computer and we'll go outside with an empty shoot box, some planting soil, some flowers, and some leaves to hunt for some caterpillars. Come on Mia, help me out while you still can. As a matter of fact, I have a garden at my house that we can search for caterpillars at. Let's go, you know, caterpillars are sure hard to find. Now, we found some. Now let's put the caterpillars in the special box along with some leaves and some flowers so they would have enough to eat. Darren, it's time to go to the store for poster board, markers, and glue. You sure need lots of stuff when you do a project. Okay, Mia, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, Darren, you too. Goodbye. 
Now that I've set up the poster board, I'm going to open the box with the caterpillars inside of it and see what happens next. Wow. Darren and Marissa, a whole bunch of butterflies flew out. And that's why caterpillars turn into butterflies when they grow up. I agree with you, Sophie and Molly. It is the best science project ever. Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out We got this far, don't know how I see danger in your eyes They know we'll go down tonight Come in just like the sun The video is over. But it doesn't have to be. Click on the subscribe button and hit the bell button to get notified for every video we produce on a certain...